What a lovely day. Tandem bike challenge. <laughs> We're out here in the woods. I'm with Louis Pilgrim. This is the new challenge bike. This is the tandem bike challenge series. And we're going to see how hammer time we can go on this thing. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> the first challenge for the tandem is to go over these two tabletops in a row. Let's see if it happens. Look, ah, oh, this sucks. The chain keeps coming off. Ow, I fell in a thorn bush. So far, this is the worst idea ever. Yeah, if you look at the chain down there, it's not very uh, on. And this is extremely loose and crap. Like this chain system's so weird because this chain links to the rear chain of like a double chain ring thing and it's like bent or something so it keeps coming off pedal back right that's the chain back on put it on there okay this is it give me that i'm gonna put that back on the tripod and we're gonna get it over these tabletops i'm on the front now Thank oh you. my god <laughs> This is by far the scariest bike I've ever been on. I'm going to put the GoPro on, we're going to ride around, see what we can find and warm up before we hit the downhill track that's over there. Right, we switched the GoPro, I've got the spinny mount on. We're just going to roll around a bit, get used to it and then just drop straight into the downhill. I'm actually used to it already. Oh God. Oh my God so hard to ride this is it we're going into the downhill right stop pedaling now Insane. Why did you almost die? Your ass and then my feet came off. Yeah? It landed like this. Oh yeah. So tandeming works downhill. Whoa! and really really horrible at the same time like in the video it might not look like we went really high but it's the worst feeling i've ever experienced in my life you should get one and try it and then you'll know what i mean that is insanely scary and it must be horrible for louis on the back because he has no control we need to do a mid session upgrade to the sky of course let's get this beast on here this is going to make it way faster look at that to the sky that's just what we just did we went to the sky and got one wheel off the ground that's well good louis like terrified i'd be terrified to be on the back of me so i'm gonna go on my own now and see what it's like as a single man tandem 
So Louis ran down there, I'm gonna try and go around that berm fast and I'm gonna hit it hard. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> oh. Okay, I, I found that if you ride it alone, you don't have a back brake because I've got the front, passenger's got the back, and it's a real bumpy ride. You like take off and because it's so long the bike stays in the ramp it's super weird i need to meet up for another rider and go extremely hard i want to go to chick sands bike park i think and do some like kind of more proper downhill <laughs> so <laughs> ridiculous what a beast definitely the scariest bike i've ever been on it's so difficult to control especially if you're at the back because you try and lean and stuff to compensate for the other guy and that makes him go out of control so it's really really interesting to ride but like these forks look how thin they are like they need changing so i'm going to put some new forks on that to make them uh, stronger i gotta stop this chain from falling off every time you pedal it the chain comes off which is really annoying the rear's fine, um, the tyres probably could do with a change, and then other than that, it's good to go. So we need to find another rider now who's willing to join in and get amongst the action, and then we're going to send it. I'd like to get in the air properly on this thing, which is going to be like a lot of careful planning of both bunny hopping at the same time, but it's going to work for sure. So what do you think? Is the tandem bike challenge a good idea? I hope it is because this bike wasn't free and I actually bought it just for you guys. So please be stoked. That'd be awesome if you'd leave some comments. It'd be sick if you'd subscribe. See you in the next one. To the sky!